this has been one of the most beautiful places I've seen on Earth so far. After cycling non-stop for 5 days, we took a saddle break and acclimatized yesterday at 4,000 meters. We were supposed to go to the ice lake but we didn't make it. So the next day we started the trekking going to Tilicho Lake. Good morning, it's our day six in an Aparna circuit. Today it's break for biking because we're gonna hike going to the highest lake in the world, Tilicho Lake. So it's gonna be six hours of walking. It's a good way to acclimatize from a higher elevation. Because I think that's my main problem in Everest Base Camp. I didn't uh, acclimatize much. And hiking here in and a poor in a secret. It's kind of different in Everest Base Camp because they're rare people. I mean, Everest Base Camp, you will see tons of people hiking. Recently, they regulated that guide is required, but they're not too strict about it. Ox Bay. Yeah. Yep. Currently, 3,500 above sea level. And later, it's going to be around 4,000 plus. So it's going to be colder. Everything within sight is stunning. We are soft trekking and you won't believe that there are like a sopa or a sopa in the middle of this in the middle of this mountain. And in the middle of Annapurna there is this estopa. Surprisingly there's also electricity in here which you wouldn't expect. This village is still like 30 minutes away. So usually I pause then look at the view for a short period of time. We just stopped by here for our lunch and look at how scenic the view is. It's just 550 minutes. Thankfully, we arrive at the next village around Bagbia. We needed to push through, and it was assault again. We passed a landslide area. It seemed kind of sketchy and hard to walk out. Now time for descent. Sadly, the rocks here are kind of loose and hiking here made me realize that views here are better than the Everest Base Camp. I took a lot of stop just to admire the beauty of Mother Earth. Finally arrive at Tilicho Base Camp at exactly 5 p.m. and time to rest and prepare for tomorrow's mm. We woke up early for breakfast and we are now ready to hike to the highest lake in the world. Today is cloudy. We started with steep climbs. It actually took us three hours. Some people are going back already because of the bad weather, but some were able to make it. It's because we started at 6.30 a.m. and we should have started at around 3.30 a.m. so we can be able to make it to the ice lake. Nine. Yeah, 9 a.m. No, wipe out na. Wipe out na. 
Uh, nag-start na mag rainfall, mag rainfall, snowfall. And ito yung kinakatakutan ko because ito yung nangyari last time. Dito ako nagkasakit. I don't want it to happen again. Pero sila, andun sila sa taas. Um, we are about 2,800? Not yet. <laughs> it's uh, 2,763. 2,763 above sea level. And, I just catch it kapag nag-snow na So, I think we're just gonna go back. We didn't make it and it's okay. Okay. It's now happening again. Snowfall. You did it too. Yeah, leg was very awesome. But it's frozen. Frozen, it's all frozen. Okay. What time did you start? We started at 4.30. Ah, that's why we yeah. started six to seven. Yeah, that's why it's like very late. <laughs> so you, or like you have to start early. Yeah. Because if you take time, then you can do it. Ah. Yeah. Okay, now we're going to sit out. Um, we're gonna head back. Oh, met. I think this is harder than you see. It all started with Anni Assault. So we go to the lake. We're gonna go back to Manang. Hopefully, we can make it with good weather. Alright, if we continue it and it snows, I don't know. I don't want it to happen again like what happened to me before. Unfortunately, the lake is surrounded by ice. That's why it's kind of like not good. It's better if it's sunny. But yeah, weather is our biggest enemy and we can control about it. So we all came from the outside and we are here. They're still out there. It's now starting to rain. Thankfully, we headed back because it's gonna be hard to walk here. And thankfully, we didn't bring our bikes because it's very hard. It's very hard. I don't know other adjectives. Descent is faster. Seven hours. It's 5:30 p.m. Sakit na lang wato namin, and I think we're three kilometers away. Ito man ang now I am back in Manang here in Tilishu Hotel. So I rode a motorcycle for like 
two kilometers. Yeah, we just realized we are not uh, hikers, but we are bikers. So tomorrow we're gonna be back on our saddle. Super tiring, sakit ng muscle. Oh, see you tomorrow.